IAFC X Faster Production Induction of HAL's Light Combat Helicopter HAL Light Combat Helicopter LCH The light combat helicopter designed and developed by the Hindustan Aeronautics Limited is a potent weapon platform and the Indian Air Force is keenly looking forward for its production and induction in the force said IAF Chief RKS Bhadoria on Friday after his maiden flight in the LCH at Bangalore India's state-owned aircraft manufacturer Hindustan Aeronautics Limited HAL recently completed high-altitude flight testing of light combat helicopter in Ladakh and Kashmir region near China and Pakistan border. R. Madhavan, chairman and managing director of HAL assured the IAF chief that the company was ready for early production of the country's first light combat aircraft to meet all the requirements of Indian Air Force. HAL Intermediate Jet Trainer Sitara successfully completes first spin test the IJT will be playing a pivotal role in pilot training general flying navigation formation flying instrument and cloud flying basic air to ground and air to air weapon aiming tactical flying and night flying the spin testing of an aircraft is the most crucial phase of its flight testing After the suitable design changes the testing will be gradually progressed to assess the behavior of the aircraft in six turns spins to either side to meet the targeted requirement The IJT will replace Kiran Jet Trainer aircraft in service with IAF for stage 2 training of its pilots IJT is fitted with AL55I jet engines produced in house at engine division Koraput IJT incorporates the simplicity necessary for ease of conversion from basic piston trainer and the sophistication required for quick conversion to the complexities of an advanced jet trainer. The IJT spin test assumes significance as this project was grounded till April last year due to design flaws and series of mishaps. China's PLA orders more J-16 fighter jets amid India border tensions. U.S. media The J-16 multi-role highly maneuverable fighter is an unauthorized clone of Sukhoi Su-35 fighter China's People's Liberation Army has ordered a new batch of heavy stealth fighter jets to be deployed on its western front as a protracted border clash with India enters its seventh month. The PLA's Western Theater Command commissioned a new fleet of Shenyang J-16 strike fighters for its air force, which already has two J-16 combat units, Chinese Communist Party newspaper Global Times reported. The new squadron of J-16s will help the air force to better safeguard China's territorial integrity, the newspaper said, claiming the Chinese-made warplanes were more technically advanced than those on the other side of the border. A modified product of the Shenyang Aircraft Corporation, the J-16 has integrated avionics and weapons systems developed by the Chinese military. It is a highly maneuverable, heavy payload fighter jet which carries air-to-air and anti-ship missiles, as well as guided bombs. China has a total of six J-16 combat units, each comprising between 32 and 36 aircraft. New variant of Broom MK3 helicopter for Indian Navy and Coast Guard slated for delivery shortly. The Indian Navy and Coast Guard's MK3 Broom helicopters feature an array of systems previously seen only on heavier, multi-role helicopters of the Indian Navy. The contract for 32 Coastal Security ALH was inked in March 2017 with ICG as the lead service. Other features include a removable medical intensive care unit for the air ambulance role, high intensity searchlight, loud hailer 12.7 mm cabin mounted machine gun with provisions on the left side traffic alert and collision avoidance system, weak UHF communication system with data modem, IFF MK12 with mode S transponder. 
automatic identification system, automatic deployable emergency location transmitter, solid state digital video recorder, pressure refueling system, 360 degree search and rescue home or with coverage from 110 to 410 megahertz, Electrical rescue winch with rescue basket for double lift, 250 kilograms, 550 pounds control grip, winchman mini stick in cabin for SC rescue, and upgraded IADS and automatic flight control system software. Such an array of systems was hitherto seen only on heavier, multi-role helicopters of the Indian Navy. Six of the 16 naval MK3 ALH are to be equipped with an indigenous low-frequency dunking sonar LFDS developed by Kochi-based Naval Physical and Oceanographic Laboratory. The sonar's units are being produced by state-owned Bharat Electronics Limited with a host of sub-vendors downstream. HAL hopes to deliver five coastal security ALH through MK3 helicopters by the end of November 2020, another nine by March 2021, and the Balance 18 helicopters by September 2021. Thanks for watching Military World Observer. Please do not forget to subscribe. Have a nice day.